Africa, agriculturally the most underutilized continent in the world, with the most potential and a population that is poised to double in the next 20 years. Thank you for the invitation to present our version of ADCO Solutions for African Agricultural Prosperity. Regional stability and policy makers have an important role to play in the success of agriculture. We have identified with fundamentals that would influence a step change. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Tom Holloway, born and raised in an agricultural community in Africa. This has inspired and developed a passion to seek solutions in a challenging environment. The most recent experience was a business development program in Mozambique, promoting agco products and innovations. Having experienced a challenging agricultural equipment sales environment, we had to relook at the strategy. We realized there is a need to develop and cre or create a mechanized customer base. So how do we achieve this? When by their own admission, our future farmer base lacks exposure to mechanization and the relevant training. After deliberations with communities and leaders, it became abundantly clear that the Institute Farm concept is required, with an emphasis on training and educating as well as understanding the benefits of forming associations or co cooperatives. The concept is to create a self-sustaining training institute as a commercial agricultural hub, supported by established education centers as the student feedstock. Initial assistance from development and aid organizations with a view to utilize profits from the institute to develop daycare centers for underprivileged or single mothers. Support from agricultural supply companies and select partners who could utilize a facility as a base for stock or a springboard to develop dealerships. Facilitate field days, research and development programs from hydroponics to large scale farming. The hub being a graduate factory or a business incubation center to create either outgrowers or standalone farmers. Additional stakeholders could be DFID, aid organizations, AGCO as the principal, and selected chain supply companies. Each company offering centralized training, education and the development of products and trainees to suit local conditions. A focus on women development is what will make this a success, as culturally, women have been instrumental in African agriculture. The facility to research and develop and implement alternative agricultural practices, introducing conservation mechanized farming. We tested this, reducing soil erosion, reducing carbon emissions, conserving residual moisture, and reintroducing organic matter. Once the academy or business incubation center has been proven a success, the concept to be copy-pasted throughout Africa. Thank you for the opportunity to present what we and our communities believe is one of three possible solutions. Good day.